I rushed the draft and rushed again because that last one was poop. You probably lose your little self trying to move how I move. You saying that I'm a bitch, will come and show me the proof. This ain't no stock, this is stick hanging out of the tube. I'm about a bag, I can show you how to jig it and move. My inner circle locked in, we ain't taking recruits. My circle all goons, we winning, we don't know how to lose. And if you slip, you getting eight. I ain't talking about food, I'm missing some screws. What's good y'all? It's your main man Daquan and I'm back with another video for y'all and in this video we're gonna be seeing how good is the Dwight Howard dunk package in 2k22. In this dunk package there's about eight animations. We're gonna be reviewing some clips and doing a breakdown at the end. We got the requirements on the bottom of the screen. Now inside the eight animations in this dunk package there's gonna be four standing dunks and then four driving dunks. And this is actually the last NBA dunk package, NBA player dunk package we're going to be reviewing. So make sure you like the video. We're going to have the ranking, the rating all coming out soon. But as far as the main driving dunk animation in this dunk package, you're really only going to get one animation and it's going to be this animation you're going to be seeing in this clip right here. And to be honest, when I first started testing out this dunk package, I wasn't even sure if the animations were popping up. First of all, this is the only dunk only driving dunk animation you're going to be getting and it just looks like a regular dunk your player will be doing like a default dunk and about this animation we're going up off of two feet but it's on a big man so it's not that bad but still also it can kind of double as a standing dunk as you can see i found myself getting the same exact animation while in a standing dunk position just because of the position and how the dunk is positioned some animations in this game are only going to trigger when you're going at a certain angle combined with a certain speed, but this one requires kind of a slower speed. So I'd really put this on the lower side of driving dunk animations for big man, as well as I wouldn't put this in a reason to use this dunk package. It doesn't have limitless takeoff. We're not going up off of one foot. You feel me? Just like a regular mid dunk. On the positive side though, we're not cocking that bitch all the way back like the Daryl Dawkins or even the Shaquille O'Neal dunk package. However, we can compare this one to the Shaquille O'Neal dunk package because in that dunk package, the, the driving dunks were not that good, but the standing dunks were pretty good. And that's really the case with this dunk package right here. The driving dunks, even though there's a couple back scratchers in there, all the animations are pretty fast. And now that I think about it, the Daryl Dawkins one was the same case too. I guess just all big man dunk packages have booty ass driving dunk animations like kind of like as they should they don't want to make them too op but if we think about the the cat wh what was they doing when they made that dunk package come on now but with that driving dunk standing dunk hybrid animation we've seen in the beginning that one will go up when you kind of have a little bit of momentum going towards the rim this one where you're kind of under the rim the fast looking one will pop up when you're about under the rim and then the back scratchers will pop up when you're a little bit farther and honestly that's not a bad setup that's not a bad rate for when they pop up because we're basically getting favored in every situation like when we're going up from far far away getting those back scratchers we're kind of pushing people out the way but overall with this dunk package if you're someone who likes to do driving dunks there is a couple of back scratching driving dunk animations that we didn't really see pop up so i wouldn't worry too much but just remember there's always that chance they could there's always that little chance of you getting your shit packed in but the standing dunks the solid dwight howard dunk package speed medium driving we'll give it a six out of ten standing dunks nine out of ten it would get a, a ten but them back scratches i don't know about those a 10 would be them daryl dawkins if y'all know about those reverse none block rate low low for me because again there's those driving dunk and there's those back scratchers we didn't really see pop up too much but three words to describe this dunk package one dimensional and just solid not too bad not too good not over the top good but just solid you know what i mean but if you enjoyed the video make sure you like comment subscribe i'm out